Mr. Bigley. Hey there guys and gals, it's Kerbeagly with another episode of Gaming with Kerbeagly and I'm once again playing the game Earthbound because it's been a while and I really love this game and it's getting really good, I mean it's been good but now it's like really good, I, I really really love this game, it's a lot of fun um, I'm glad that a lot of you out there really enjoyed as well Now last episode we fought a crazy hard boss who almost kicked the shit out of us and I actually got worried, I got worried we were going to lose to the um, Your Sanctuary boss there um, his, he was called, like, the Trillion Age Sprout or something. Anyway, we also had a cup of coffee, which seemed to be laced with acid, because it just, it was cra- it was a crazy time. It was a very crazy time in the time of Ness and his party, or Gerbigli and his party, I'm sorry. I renamed everybody. I always forget that, and I keep calling him Ness. But he's me! He's me! He's Gerbigli! Yeah! So anyway, um... Last episode, at the end of it, I had no idea what I was supposed to do. I was told that I need to head back to Threed, which is my next destination. So we'll head there, and, um, whoa, okay, this guy wants to fight. Little roach guy. Really? The violent roach, I guess you're violent. I mean, you're, like, way under-leveled compared to me, violent roach. You're gonna get killed. You're gonna get squished. Super quick. You're dead. You're dead already. You're done. Done. Dunzo. Deadzo. <laughs> um... Anyway, so, uh, yeah, that was weird. I guess he's, if he's violent, he just attacks everyone. But, um, what I was trying to say was, uh, I have to head back to Threed, and then, I, I guess, um, things happen there. Oh, wow, everything wants to fight me. What the hell? I should be, like, super leveled compared to you idiots. You jerkos. Red Antoids. Red Antoids, my butt. Okay. Oh, crap. Okay, and I learned a couple new spells that you guys can probably see there. I am, like, pretty OP for this point in the game, but, um, that's, I mean, for me, that's okay, because, uh, for this series, I really just want to, I want to be able to get to the story for you guys, and I looked up something online, um, I announced this on Twitter, actually, I think it was earlier yesterday or something like that, um, but I mentioned that I looked up, like, a general overview of the game. It didn't spoil anything, uh, but the game guide basically said that I'm only about halfway through this game, or less than halfway through this game, and that's with me grinding off camera uh, in between episodes so that I'm, like, the, str the strongest possible, that I can just rush through the game and get to the story. Um, so that's pretty insane to me that we have that much of the game left. For some reason, I have, like, saliva just building up in my mouth like a ton. Blah, blah, blah. Um, oh man, this single frog? Really? You, you wanna go, dude? Like, you're, you're, you're one frog. I don't care that you're armored, you're gonna get messed up pretty bad, dude. Bam, bam! Oh, you're gonna get super- oh, you're messed up. Oh, man, you're not messed up. Ha! But we dodged it. You little- Oh, well, you dodged it. We got him. We got him! Yeah! Take that. In the face. But yeah, um, Earthbound, retro gaming at its finest. I really like this game a lot. It's a ton of fun. Uh, it makes me super happy to play it. So, we will just continue our way to Threed here. I don't know what's changed there. I I think um, I think we should be able to get through the tunnel to Foreside now, though, which is going to be great. Oh, that's right. There's this uh, creepy transitional tunnel cave system here. Totally forgot about this. Let's get it going. Hey, everything's gone in here. Are all the enemies gone now? Because I uh, I killed that boss... So now the zombies are gone, I guess. That makes sense. I wonder if all the ghosts are gone, too. I mean, the ghosts will probably have to be gone, because the ghosts are what were preventing me from going from 3 to 4 side originally. So, let's hope that that's the case. Because if I have to fight those ghosty goos again, and they give me the little ghost uh, possession status element, that status element's so annoying. Wow, it's all sunny and bright and happy. Oh my god, hello, people. Thank you for bringing peace and happiness back to three. Thanks. Peace. Love. I won't forget you. Won't you come back to three sometime? I really didn't think those kids could save the town. Who would have ever imagined it? Since the leader of the monsters has gone, the ghosts in the tunnel have disappeared. The buses can get through the tunnel now. Yay. Okay. Awesome. So I was right. We're going to be able to go to four side now. So let's go uh, catch a bus ride. Catch a ride. For those of you who play Borderlands, you'll know what I'm referencing. Hey, geeky guy, you look like you're important. I want to go through the desert and onto the big city. I want to see the city and I want to smell like the big city. I'm a real urban type of guy. Okay, yeah, you certainly seem that way. <laughs> All 
Alright, peace out everyone. None of you have anything useful to say to me, so I'm gonna go to the bus stop. Check it. Danger, do not stand in the street. Oh, okay, sorry. <laughs> Alright. Looks like the next bus will come pretty soon. Better come right now. Yeah, there it is. How convenient. This bus goes to Foreside. I can't let you on if you don't pay six dollars for the fare. Of course I want to pay six bucks. Let's go ahead. Oh yeah, I forgot about the awesome groovy bus tune. This is the best theme ever. Oh yeah! Okay, I'm done. <laughs> oh man, this game's so fun though. I love it. Everything about it is just so lighthearted and just enjoyable. So we made it through the tunnel. Made it through the tunnel, no ghosty goos. I wonder if there's gonna be like a boss fight or something coming up though. Like the boss gets attacked by like a big evil monster face. Maybe a living cactus. That would fit the theme of this game. Drugs. That sign just said drugs. <laughs> drugs. Man, it's bumper to bumper. My job is to drive so I can't get off the bus. It's up to you if you want to get off the bus and walk around in the desert. Hey, it's a free country. Really? Hey, we're sweating. <laughs> we're, in the, we're in the desert, so we're sweating. All right, what's the big deal here, guys? Welcome to the very end of the world's longest traffic jam. Oh, awesome. All right, so this is the drugs drugstore, I'm assuming? Oh, okay, all right. It's just a shop. Hello there, how may I help you? Let's buy some stuff. Ooh, we got new weapons. We got new weapons that we can um, buy, and there's coin of slumber. Who disturbs my coin of slumber? Excuse me, I got the burpees, guys. Oh, God damn it! I hate the burpees. I really hate them, stop giving them to me. Oh, I can't carry anything else. Yes, yes, yes. I do want to sell some stuff so that I can carry this very awesome awesomeness. All right, what do I want to sell? Uh, let's sell the, uh, stag beetle. I don't, I don't give a shit about the stag beetle. Yeah, four bucks for that thing. Look at all the money I have, by the way. Grinding is... It's just what I do. It's just what I do. Okay. Mr. Baseball Bat is what... <laughs> okay. Alright. So that's gonna make us super strong. Wow, that actually added a ton of strength. That's awesome. Yeah, take that bionic slingshot. It sucks. Um, and then I was also told I should buy... Uh, the the deluxe frying pan because even though it does less or a little less damage is a lot more accurate than the slingshot so I'm gonna give that to I guess um well yeah that's okay all right all right fine I guess I'll have to carry it and then I um and then I will have to sell some stuff crap Oh, wait, I have to do that first. Damn it! I, I hate the inventory system in this game. I mean, this is basically how a lot of inventory systems were back back in the day. So, it's something that I, uh, I'm i semi-used to, but it's just, you know, it's such an archaic thing. And uh, it makes me sad inside. Yeah, yeah, we'll sell the ribbon. I don't need that ribbon. Can I get you anything else? Yes! Oh, wait, no! Get out of here! Boom, 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 boom. Okay, I can't equip it yet. God damn it. See, I have to move stuff. Oh, let's get through this. Let's get through it. Okay, there we go. Then I can equip it. No, not you. Ugh. Okay, so it only drops our offense by two. That's not too bad. And then... How will... Uh, oh, yeah, I need the uh, the coin of slumber for for me. I will carry it, and I will equip it. Yay, my defense. Yeah, buy that hard hat. You're welcome. No, thank you for your help, merchant man. Let's go ahead and get the hell out of here, though. Actually, we should probably save. Crap. <laughs> I didn't even think about that. We gotta save quick, guys, because uh, otherwise we're gonna... We're gonna die. We're definitely gonna die. Oh my god, that is a lot of money. That is a lot of money in the bank. I will definitely be taking that money soon. Anyway, what do you need from me? Let's just record quick. Dad, shut up. You just talk all the time. I have created a record. Blah, blah, blah. Good night. Sleep tight. Like to work hard. Like your mom. And like you, Dad, who's always on the phone. 
or sleeping, apparently. You're always sleeping. If I went and I saved again right now, you'd still be sleeping. What a ridiculous person. All right, so um, let's try to make our way through the traffic jam, I guess. What the hell? God damn it. Ah, so we can't go through that way. Guess we got to go up here north. North ways? Hey, buddy. What's up, sweatsuit guy? Why are you in a sweatsuit? Shh, don't talk too loud. What do you want? Oh, what do you got for me, man? Illegal goods? Zip gun. Ooh. <laughs> All right. Aw, oh, man. It's another situation where I guess I got to hold it. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's fine, that's fine. We need the zip gun. Sounds cool, I don't know what it's gonna do for me, but... Oh wait, crap, did you have anything else? Dude, this is like a black market, this is awesome. Should be black markets everywhere. Okay, there's nothing. Keep on a watch for bad guys. Oh, I'll, I'll, I'll do that, man. I will. Okay. Um... Let's just eat it. Let's just eat the quistle. Eat it! Mm -hmm -hmm. Oh... Okay. Now I can... Now I can give the zip gun to Dobby. Go, Dobby! I love the music in this game. It's so good. Everyth everything about this game is great. Magnum air gun. Okay. So that increased our, uh, our offense by, like, four. That's pretty good. Okay. All right. Let's just go. Let's get... Okay. Or we'll get trapped there automatically. I like that they're sweating. That's funny. It's a good little touch. I like... I like the little aesthetics in this game. Ooh, what's that? <gasps> Is that Bubble Monkey? Coo 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 coo, welcome! Kiki 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 ki. Our paradise exists beneath that hole! Coo 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 kiki ki. Talarama is great and kind! Kiki ki ki, coo coo coo! And he knows everything Talarama does! He made us the underground rooms! Cool, let's go down there! What the hell is this? Oh yeah! Listen to that jam! Climbing down creepy monkey holes! Whoa, that guy is floating! Is that- that's probably Talarama. He's fasting and practicing silent meditation. He's abstaining from anything that would make him sick or smelly, too. <laughs> Please don't bother him. Too bad I'm bothering him. You... I, uh, I assume that he moves at some point. I don't know. I don't know what I have to do for him. Whatever. Maybe uh, maybe I have to give bubblegum to the monkeys, because my first monkey really liked bubblegum. Oh my god. That's a spaceship. Hi, spaceship. Peace out. Get the hell away from me. Cool! So this is the desert. Wow, this is the desert. Hey, that's another butterfly. <laughs> Alright. Not a lot of enemies here in the desert. That's fine by me. Oh, hello, buffalo. Oh! He wants to fight. He wants to tangle with Ness and crew. Or me. Grabiglian crew. That's what I meant. Alright. Let's just... Let's test out our new weapons. You missed! What the hell? The whole reason you have that is to be stronger, you stupid... All right, rammed and trampled you. Ooh, whoo, that's good, he missed. That sounds like it was a, would have hurt a lot. I mean, I don't know if you guys have ever been rammed and trampled by anything. Holy shit, critical hit. But it, it's, it's painful. Yeah, take that, buffalo. Oh yes, we've gained a lot of experience from that. Damn, that, from one enemy, really? That's, that's pretty damn good, actually. There's a big bottle rocket inside. Cool. All right. Ooh, what's this? Dusty Dunes headquarters for finding buried gold. Cool. Hi, buddy. This hole's great. Good hole, good hole, good hole. Dude, dude, do you want to be saying that out loud? <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> what the hell? First, someone asked me to dig for buried gold. I began to feel like I was uh, obligated to find it. Man, am I starving. Do you have any food you can spare? Uh, sure, dude. I have tons of food. Seems like you have a lot of stuff. What are you going to give me? Not picnic lunch? I'm not going to give him picnic lunch. That's mine. No, a skip sandwich, maybe? Excuse me. Oh, bread roll. Oh, shit. No, I didn't mean to hit that. Pizza would work. Okay. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Good hole, good hole. No, I want to feed you. I want to feed you the bread roll, but I accidentally hit the cancel button. God damn it. I've, I fat fingered it. All right. Let's give him bread roll. You're not getting a pack of bubble gum. I need that for Bubble Monkey. Bubble Monkey needs to come back. I miss Bubble Monkey so much. When you find a gold, I'll give it to you. Really? Wow. Hey, wait a second. What? Wait a second what? What are you talking about, dude? Oh, hi, other guy. Do you want food, too? It's a small house, but please stay the night. Oh. Okay, I guess I didn't have a choice. Holy crap. He was just like... Oh. By the way, you can sleep here if you want. 
on this dirty couch and mattress. Oh, gross. Oh, God, we have fleas now. Guaranteed. All right, let's save again. All right, Dad. Ooh, that buffalo gave me 172 bucks. Man, that buffalo is rich for a buffalo. And uh, actually, guys, I think I'm probably going to end the episode there. We did a lot of exploring. We actually progressed the game, which was nice. Sorry there wasn't a ton of action, but... Um, that's kind of the point of the game. Like I said, the series is all about uh, getting to the the awesome story at work here. I, I really love this game. It's a lot of fun. Um, I'll do some grinding in the meantime. And uh, hopefully uh, next episode will make even more progress. But um, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, please be sure to hit the like button, share the video, and favorite it. Also, be sure to subscribe to me if you guys haven't already. For those of you who have, thank you so much for all of your support. You guys are the best in the world. I love every single one of you. And as always, it was great seeing you. Bye-bye. I don't know, you know what, we did split the pie with her, so let's split the ice cream with her. Hand me a spoon. <laughs> Dig in. I, I bet this is a nice bonding experience for Virginia and her anyway, so at least that's what I'm hoping. I hope it doesn't come back to, like, bite me in the ass, literally, and I have, like, diarrhea for a day or something in the game.